What's up everybody? So today we found a used turbo kit for $160 and it is a GT3076 R top mount turbo setup for my SR20 DT. And yes, like I said, $160 and we'll test this turbo out so you guys can see us rip this thing out. All right, we gotta take out this bottom mount setup. But before we do that, you guys know the Rising Night family is all about family, cars, and food. Y'all ready? Alright, so Sai went ahead and got all the stuff on top done. Now they go under the car, take off the downpipe, disconnect it from the exhaust. And up here, the manifold, the bottom mount turbo, and the turbo elbow will come up. The bottom, I'll take the downpipe off and we'll continue from there. Sai got the best power to ever. Oh, yeah, I got the downpipe off. Okay, so down pipes out. Gotta come flip the steak. Woo! Sizzling. So you gotta know how to fix car and grill at the same time. This is the GT 3076R and the GT 28RS. So yeah, this one has a two and a half inlet to a four inch inlet, but you know the real powers come back from the turbine. All right, guys, cannot wait to feel how the Mantis pulls on top mount turbo. <laughs> Got what we needed, some clamps, some hoses. Let's go back and get that top mount running. All right, so it's taking us a little longer than usual because we ran to some small stuff. I had to run to the store to go grab some other stuff. If you know, whenever you touch a car, you always run to small stuff, and you always have to go back and forth to the auto parts store. But Luckily, my sister-in-law gave us the spotlight we've been using it's really for photography, but you know, this is for videos too, so. This is gonna be our saver for every night we work in the car. take this one out. Thanks to the Rising Eye family for helping me mount the GT 3076R turbo to the manifold. And here's the Westgate. This dump pound is going to sound like this. Dude, what if they hit my screen? I thought it was a car. Oh, this thing's heavy. Oh. Turbo is mounted on super excited because this turbo kit only costs us $160 on the market and it comes with the whole thing 
like downpipe, turbo, manifold, Westgate, screamer pipe, all that good stuff. And we'll show you guys that $160 turbo kit can rip. Turbo is finally in. There's some stuff that we gotta tweak a little bit. Like uh, I gotta get some more long hoses tomorrow, but everything else looks good so far. Pour some fresh water into it, and then we're gonna crank it up. But before we can crank it up, anytime you put a new turbo in it, unplug your cast, cam angle sensor, and then turn it over a couple times so the turbo can go into the bearings and all that good stuff. And then after that, we'll plug it back up and crank it. Yep. And now we're going to plug it up. Sounds good, man. It sounds like a completely new motor with the top mount sound difference to the bottom mount. I think I like it more. It sounds way more aggressive. And then yeah, whoo, super super thankful for the Ryzen 9 family. Hope you guys are also enjoying this build. Well, that's it for today. The car turns on good. Turbo sounds nice. Tomorrow we're gonna get up, test and tune this thing, and then have a fun ride with it. Hope you guys enjoy. See you guys next time.